One night, Hazrat Usaid bin Hudair was reciting the Quran in his barn. Suddenly, his mare started skipping. He started reciting again and it started springing again. He again started reciting and it again started skipping. He says, I got scared lest it should trample Yahya his son. So I went and stood beside it to see a canopy in which some lamp-like things were sparkling over my head. The canopy started ascending and even went out of my sight. In the morning, I visited Allah's Apostle sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and submitted. O Allah's Apostle sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, last night when I was reciting the Quran in my granary, suddenly my mare started skipping. Allah's Apostle sallallahu alayhi wa sallam thereupon said, O Ibn Hudair, keep on reciting. He submitted, I keep reciting, but it again started shying. Allah's Apostle sallallahu alayhi wa sallam again said, O Ibn Hudair, keep reciting. He submitted, I continued reciting, but it again started skipping. Allah's Apostle sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, O Ibn Hudair, keep reciting. He submitted, I went back and Yahya, his son, was near the mare. I got frightened lest it should trample Yahya. I saw a canopy-like thing inside which there were some lamp-like things. It was ascending towards the sky and even went out of my sight. Allah's Apostle sallallahu alayhi wa sallam whereupon said, They were the angels who were listening to your recitation. If you had continued reciting till morning, the other people would also have cited them and they, the angels, would not remain hidden from them. Note, it transpires that it is possible for general ummah to witness angels. Sahih Muslim, Hadith number 1856